Oh, thank you. Four stops in two hours with just a handful of voters, most of whom had never heard of Virgil Goode before. But a presidential candidate always gets a photo op, and it doesn't phase Goode one bit. When you campaign, when, like I did for state senate for a number of times and for Congress, uh, even then some people didn't know you. Goode's a veteran of Virginia politics and of nearly all its parties. He spent 36 years in office, 12 of them in Congress, first as a Democrat, then an independent, and most recently a Republican. Now he's running for president under the banner of the very conservative Constitution Party, with a low-budget grassroots campaign, including some $60,000 out of his own pocket. This is for an emergency breakfast. <laughs> But that little campaign could make a big difference. Good is polling at 1 to 2 percent in Virginia. If he peels enough Republican votes away, it could hand that key state to Obama. And that upsets some Mitt Romney fans. And God bless America and everything, but I am against Obama. I will go with Romney. And, you know, and I just really I hope I you don't upset it. But he does throw it all off when we have a chance to actually get Obama out of the office. Um, you know, Virginia's a pretty important state here, and he's in Virginia. Good finally gets a warm welcome from supporters who share his views. Anti-immigration, anti-gay marriage, pro-gun, small government, far more conservative than the big party candidates. It's not much difference between Romney and Obama on super PACs, term limits, I doubt if it's any, and certainly not on ending illegal immigration and reducing legal immigration. Good has virtually no chance of making it to the White House, but if he helps decide who gets there, it might finally put his campaign on the map.